Hey guys, it's Ashlyn. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing my makeup collection and like vanity tour. This video has been so highly requested for ever since I posted my last one. I've done like a few of these before, but it's been a bit since I've done another one. So I'm finally going to be doing one. And I'm really excited to show you guys because my makeup collection has definitely grown since the last one. And I also have gotten a vanity. I've moved rooms since my last makeup collection. So it's just all organized better. I actually just cleaned everything today and like decluttered some things. I gave some things to my mom and my sister. So it's like organized better. It's just so much better. So um, I hope you guys enjoy and I know this is going to be a little bit of a longer video. So um, let's go ahead. Hello? Okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started. Here's like an overview of it all. Like this is kind of just how I have it set up i have the alex five drawers right here and then the alex nine drawers over there and then just like the ikea tabletop and then i just have this huge mirror i think it's from like one of our neighbors i'm not really quite sure over here i have just some beauty blenders and these things are from ikea and then this i made or like i painted out a pottery thing it's nothing it's just like a decoration i have some tape honestly i don't really know why i think it's just kind of just like a decoration and my mario badescu drying lotion back there then this mirror is also from ikea it has like two sides i should probably turn my ringer off then i just have a coaster this remote is for my lights up there which are from walmart i have three of the ikea little i think they're actually candle holders but i use them for my brushes so i just have my eye brushes smaller face brushes and larger face brushes then this is a bluetooth speaker and it also has like there's two usb ones and then two plugins and it's also an alarm clock so this is from amazon i'm not quite sure what it's called but it's really nice if you can find it these aren't really interesting they're there's no makeup in them, but I'm going to show it to you anyway in case you are wondering what's in it. Here is just kind of just like skincare stuff. I'm not going to go in depth with it. I'm just going to kind of show you. It's not really interesting. This is just like random stuff, just like hair stuff. Then in this one, it's a bunch of masks. This is literally all face masks. Most of them are Freeman masks, which is, are my favorite ones. Right here is just all my Scentsies. I have a lot. Literally, I have an obsession with them. But they're amazing, and you'll see my Scentsy when we get to my nine drawers. And then down here is just randomness again. But all this makeup you see here, I'm selling on my Poshmark. So it'll be down below if you want to follow it. Okay, now to the nine drawers. On the top, I just have this like lotion stuff that my mom made. I don't know, I kind of just have it there as a decoration because I don't really use it that much. These three plants are from Ikea. This is my Scentsy. It's an elephant, <laughs> obviously. And I have one in right now and I literally always have this going and it was like 10 or $15 from Walmart. In my first drawer, this has never actually had makeup in it until today. Like usually I just had it for random stuff, but now there's actually a use for it in here i have my eyebrow stuff color correctors this is just like some halloween paint stuff and then eyelashes so i'm gonna quickly just like give you a rundown of what's in it i just have like a folk alert brow pencil billion dollar brow elf eyler this benefit foolproof brow powder i have some eyebrow gels i don't know if you guys like really care about each individual thing that's in it. This is my favorite eyebrow gel. This is the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. My favorite brow pencil is the NYX Micro Brow. And I just have these two eye primers. I don't really use them that much, but it's the Essence one and the Urban Decay one. I have these two Sephora ones, Essence one. And then these two Halloween ones, I don't sleep like, they're just kind of like good to have. I have a NYX eyeliner sharpener. The lashes that I have, these are my favorite ones, which I've used way too many times. Oh, oh my gosh, my battery is already flashing. Oh my gosh. Like I was saying, these are my favorite lashes. They're the Lashaholic Luxury Lashes in the style Instaglam. I got them in my boxy charm a while ago, but I would definitely get them. These Sephora lashes. I have a pair of Huda Beauty lashes, but they're like not my favorite to be honest. They just don't really look good on my eyes, but they are really nice eyelashes. These are just kind of like miscellaneous ones. These are lashes, but you can't get them anymore because the company like stopped making things, I guess. And then these are ones from Shop Miss A. These are really nice. I just used them yesterday. So that's all for the first drawer. And and now for the second drawer, we have primers and concealers. I kind of just like, I don't know. I don't have like, any method to this. I just kind of have them like sorted somehow. I don't need this many like containers of primers, but it's nice to like be able to see them. And this one, I just have milk ones. I have two cooling water sticks, just the big one in the mini size. Two blur sticks. These are two primerizers. This is my favorite primer probably. This is like a mini size and this is like an even smaller size, which is almost out. Back here, I have ones in kind of like tubes. So this is one from Shot Masse. I have this Bosha one. The 
Smashbox primer. I really like that one. The photo finish is so good. Then the Clarins Instant Poreless one and the Benefit Professional. Over here, I have the No Pore Bone Primer by Primer by Touch and Soul. And then this is a Guerlain one. It's really good, but it's just so expensive. And right here, I have two Becca primers, the First Light Priming Filter and the Backlight Priming Filter. As for concealers, we have the Amuse Cosmetics one from Shop Miss A. It's only a dollar. And then just a bunch of concealers, so I'll quickly run through them. Um, this one I use sometimes for like liquid contour, but it's still too even too dark for that. But but sometimes I use it for that. This Maybelline Fit Me one, which is probably like one of the best drugstore ones. Then the ColourPop one. I have two Tarte Shape Tapes. I have a lighter one and then a darker one. The Born This Way one. This is a Becca one. The one I've been using the most recently is the Maybelline Better Skin, but it's almost out. Then the Wet n Wild one and the Makeup Revolution Concealer. For the third drawer, we have setting powders and foundations. So back here are my loose powders. We got the milk one, another one from Shop Miss A. There's the mini size of the Laura Mercier in the full size, the pretty vulgar one. This is a Focaler one. Then the ColourPop no filter setting powder. This is a mini Makeup Forever one. Becca Set and Refresh and the Cody Airspun. Right here, I just have one of the containers of foundations. These are two of the Fit Me ones. There's the Doing Smooth and the Matte and Poreless. Then the ColourPop one. There's two of the Photo Focus ones by Wet n Wild, the Milani Conceal in Perfect, and this is the old packaging of the Becca Ultimate Coverage Complexion Cream. I actually have the new packaging of it on my Poshmark. Right here are just like three pressed powders. So there's the Wet n Wild one and then two of the Rimmel Stay Matte powders. This one's just translucent and this one is in the shade Silky Beige. These are more like lighter coverage like bb cream type tinted moisturizers this is the number seven tinted moisturizer and then the first aid beauty tinted moisturizers there's just two of them this is one from shop miss a and this is the number seven skin perfector it's not like a tinted moisturizer but it's not a foundation in the fourth drawer this is a drawer full of highlighters bronzers and blushes starting out with the bronzers um there's like an elf bronzer and blush duo back there then the nars one in casino this is the hula light and then the hula bronzer under all of this there's the wet n wild one the Too faced chocolate soleil the nyc smooth skin bronzer this one is from shop miss a and then the tarte park avenue princess this is just the matte one for blushes i actually love blush back here is an anastasia trio then this is another thing from Shop Miss A. Makeup Revolution Blush, Essence Satin Touch Blush, and Satin Coral. This is my favorite blush, which is the Tarte Blush in Party. Right here is another Tarte Blush, and this one is in the shade Blissful. And then Too Faced Love Flush Blush in Love Hangover. Baby Love Essence Blush. You can put this in a Z palette, but I don't have one. But it's in the shade Rosy Glow. For my cream slash liquid blushes, this is an NYX one which you can put on your cheeks or lips but I like to use on my cheeks. Then this is my favorite blush that I have been using recently and it's the milk one in the shade Work. And right here is just a Clarins Glow To Go duo kind of blush and highlighter thing. Okay, I actually have a lot of highlighters and I kind of didn't realize how many highlighters I have. Kind of just give you a rundown. So back here is just an Ofra like trio thing. Looks like this. It has Star Island, Bali, and Blissful. My favorite highlighter formula is definitely like Anastasia ones or Ofra ones. So that's why I have so many. The Anastasia Amrezy highlighter. These are my three Ofra highlighters. We have Pillow Talk, Space Baby, and this one, Cloud Nine, I believe. Yeah. And I love these so much. Okay. Since all of these are packed so much, I won't be able to like get them out and show them all to you, but You'll kind of like get the gist of what it is. This one is the Becca one and it's their like pig highlighter, which I'm obsessed with. I use it so much. This is their pig highlighter. It is so pretty. This is the one ingredient glow, which is like a bunch of their highlighters all in one. And then this one is bronzed amber. Back here, there's two wet and wild highlighters. We have precious petals and blossom glow. Then this Lancome highlighter and another mini Becca highlighter in rose gold. Back here is a pixie highlighter and then two color pop ones. There's Flexitarian and Lunch Money. I have three of the milk 
mini little highlighters this one is my favorite one i actually use it like every day it's in the shade lit this came in my boxy charm and it's the cover effects glitter drops which are actually so pretty this big thing right here is the lancome like rose highlighter i'll try to get it open without like knocking everything over everything is falling but it looks like that I also have this little like stick highlighter thing. Also, I'm gonna finish my highlighters down here because it's kind of like easier. <laughs> and there's a little like Becca liquid highlighter in opal and the Shop Masse like highlighter and a Makeup Revolution triple baked highlighter. Another Makeup Revolution highlighter in golden lights. So that's all my highlighters. In the next drawer, I just have mascaras, single eyeshadows and glitters, and then eyeliners. So back here for mascaras, my favorite is the Too Faced BTS. That's why I have two. There is a Tarte Lights Crema Lashes, a Lancome one. There's like a more Lancome ones throughout here that are just like colored. The It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara. This is a Shot Masse one again. If you're wondering why I have so much Shot Masse, it's because they sent me like a big package full of makeup so I could do like a full face. This is the Milk Kush Mascara, which I really like. Another Tarte Mascara and the Colonnade Mascara. That's basically all that. This is, I think, the Equate eyelash color and I use it all the time. I love it. Over here are the single eyeshadows. So I have a lot of just like NYX glitters over here. There's four ColourPop eyeshadows. This is a little Anastasia eyeshadow. I don't really know why I got it. I got it at TJ Maxx. I don't really have a place to put it, so it just kind of sits there. For eyeliners, these are all of my colored eyeliners, and these are just like my black eyeliners. I also have an eyelash glue in here, which I need to put up there. Right here is just like a Bang Cosmetics little eyeliner. I It's just like a brown color, and just like a bunch of colored eyeliners. Um, I have quite a bit of these NYX Vivid Brights eyeliners in different colors. I don't know, just like white eyeliners. I also have these two glitter eyeliners and they are from Shop Masse as well. Over here, I just have my black eyeliners and this is my favorite one by far, the Fenty Beauty Fly Liner. Just a bunch of different ones. Not really anything too interesting. Okay, so this, I was actually so proud of because I organized it all today. There was like no organization in here at all, but now there finally is, so this is most of my lip products honestly i don't know how i ended up with so many lip products but they just kind of like come on their own so i'm gonna go through them i have a lot of ofra liquid lipsticks and these are my favorite formulas i love them so much their new packaging is so nice so many of these are the nyx liquid suede's i got them in a vault there's just a ton of them there's like a bright orange or bright blue there's just all the colors you would need. And then I have the Fenty Beauty lip gloss. These Grande Lips ones are like plumping lip glosses. I got the whole collection of the Lancome Juicy Tubes in a package, but my mom took one and my t sister took two. So these are the ones that I'm left with. Right over here are some of the Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suits. These are actually pretty good formulas from the drugstore. Over here is a Smashbox liquid lipstick that I got from my Boxy Charm a couple of times ago. These are some Tarte lipsticks and they are from the Rainforest of the Sea line. I have the shade Rum Punch, which is so pretty, and Colada. Both of them are really nice nude shades. This is a Glam Glow Lip Plumper. Then there's two Ofra Liquid Lipsticks. This is just their older packaging. Over here are two Focaler Liquid Lipsticks. In the back, there's three of the Marc Jacobs lipsticks and then a Clinique one back there. This is a Jordana like holographic lip gloss. Five of the MAC lipsticks and over here are a ton of the Too Faced melted lipstick things. Um, I have so many because I got them from TJ Maxx and I don't know why but like I was in a phase where I would get them like every single time I went to TJ Maxx. Don't know why. Oh and over here this is a Kevin Aquan lip gloss. That's the majority of them but in the next drawer there are some more so we got two kat von d lipsticks urban decay one two sephora ones this one's from shop masse and so is this one it's a lip gloss and a liquid lipstick here's a ColourPop lip gloss in aquarius a makeup forever liquid lipstick anastasia lip gloss lipstick queen it's like a lip stain thing here's just a focaler liquid lipstick and then a tart lip gloss a tart lip paint kat von d liquid lipstick and a bare minerals one here is for Too Faced lip injections lip glosses. Right here is a deck of Scarlet, like it's like a glitter lip 
gloss thing. Then another Kat Von D look lipstick. It's just a mini size, a buxom one. And then this is a Fenty Beauty lipstick. It's a bright pink shade. And then another Tarte lip paint. Over here is just kind of like lipsticks, like like more pencil-like things. So this one's for my boxy charm, and then this ColourPop lippy stick. This is just like a Lancome thing. I think it's more of an eyeliner, but it's just like in here for no reason. I don't know why. A Lorac lick lip thing and behind it all are my face palettes we got the shade and light palette the anastasia sugar glow kit the anastasia sun dip glow kit the anastasia aurora glow kit then the ofra like highlighter palette the anastasia cream contour kit deck of scarlet palette i'm not sure which one this is but it's like a collab with a youtuber you can't really see this but it's a lancome face palette and then a cover fx face palette the tarte little blush book thing oh my goodness i'm like running out of breath so in this drawer it's finally organized my palettes used to be so just like thrown in here but now they have organization i'm gonna start over here and if you guys want i can do like a palette collection and go more in depth and i can like open them all up and swatch them if you want but in this video it would take too long, so I'm just gonna go ahead and run through them quickly. So we got the Too Faced Bon Bon Palette, the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette, the Too Faced Peanut Butter and Jelly, and Natural Eyes Palette. Right here is a Laura Lee, the Cat's, pa not Cat's Pajamas, this is a Party Animal Palette. Got it my boxy charm one month. All of these four palettes are Focaler palettes. This, I believe, is called the Night Elf Palette. This one is the So Hot Palette. This is the you Care We Care Your Favors Palette, and then the Sweet as Honey Palette. These four are color palette palettes. So we got All I See is Magic Palette, Golden State of Mind, My Little Pony, and the you add me at hello palette these are all anastasia palettes the subculture of the soft glam and the modern renaissance this is one also for my boxy charm it's the ace beauty palette and then a sorme cosmetics palette a lancome palette and back down here is just this little tart flirt palette back here are super duper big palettes they're all from morphe so we got the 35b the jaclyn hill and down here is the james charles palette and that concludes my whole makeup collection oh my gosh if you're wondering what's in this drawer it's just like setting sprays it's nothing special but so that is it for my makeup collection i hope you guys enjoyed again i didn't like say it at the beginning but please just keep your comments to yourself if you have like hate i mean i know there's gonna be any there's no way to spot stop it but i did want to say like don't think i'm spoiled or anything i pay for all this makeup with my own money or it was from my birthday or christmas another way that i get it is if it's sent to me which is mainly how i get it now because um it is like my job and it's like what my channel is basically so yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed you guys have been wanting it for a long time so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys so much don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!